Welcome back to having fun and cooking with me. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank okay. Thank you. Thank you. I was talking to my mom on the phone and uh, she was telling me about how she had some mashed potatoes and it made me extremely jealous. So I'm going to have some too. So the first thing you need for mashed potatoes are some potatoes. My first step with these is going to be to peel them. Right now we're making some potatoes. So this one's done now. And now I'm going to show you what starting on another one feels like. It feels like that. You just you just make the first cut and then you do it until it's until it's naked. Don't need this anymore. I know what I sound like. So now that all of the potatoes are completely naked, it's time for them to all go into their hot tub together. This might be too hot for YouTube, but I guess we're just pushing the boundaries here. Dun, da, da, da. You want to put a little bit of salt in there? I'll show you what salt looks like. Who am I kidding? You guys are too sweet. I don't want to be salty to you. These potatoes, they've been living in my fridge for a long time. They've probably been there for like a month. And I just relocated them and they didn't even know what was going on. Like I didn't even give them any forewarning. Just one day you're sitting in the bottom drawer of a refrigerator and the next you're being skinned and put into a hot sauna with all of your besties. A big naked bath with all of your friends. Just like the ancients used to do. Good thing they did in ancient Rome. You just bathe with all your besties in the nude. They had, they didn't care. But this, I mean, this is like a vacation for the potatoes. They're probably enjoying it, right? Does that look like a fun time to you? I should stop speculating and I should just ask them. Potatoes, how's it feeling in there? Well, that's cool, but do you guys know what the secret ingredient for these mashed potatoes are gonna be? Oh, you silly rascals, you. They seem pretty content. We can go to bed and sleep soundly tonight. You want to make sure that they're easy to stab through because you're gonna have to mash them into tiny little pieces and it's easier to mash if it's easy to stab. That's a pro tip. How many do you think I can get on this fork? Oh, I almost got two. Perfect. This wait time is forever. Even the microwave is sweating with anticipation. Oh, I just burnt some of my hair. We need a colander and we have one, so we're doing good. Place that in the sink. Make sure you do not burn your hands off as you make your mashed potatoes. Otherwise, their enjoyment will be greatly lessened. We're gonna get our pot. Bam. And then we're gonna get our potato. Bam. Let's mash and bash together, shall we? You wanna mash? I don't wanna bash. The time has come. I'm losing potatoes here. Make sure not to lose the potatoes. Don't mash violently. Mash with purpose, but not with fervor. They're looking good. They're looking nice. Now that we have them all mashed up, we're gonna get to put on the good stuff. I'm gonna put in some everyday seasoning from my boy, Trader Joe's. I'm a pirate with a mic on my shoulder. We're gonna crack in this pepper. Mix it up, mix it up, mix it up. Before the potatoes get cold, this is important, before the potatoes get cold, look at me, look at me, in my eyes right now, before they get cold, butter. Yeah, you better believe it's butter. Remember, the amount of butter you put in is the amount of butter you're going to eat. But the amount of butter you eat is usually proportional to the amount of happiness that you're gonna experience during the day. So, uh, this one's for you, Rachel Ray. Ba-bam. I've teased you for too long. The time has come, ladies and gentlemen. Sour cream. Make sure you get a big spoon because you're gonna wanna put a lot of sour cream in there. You have the sour cream, you take the spoon, you put the spoon in the sour cream, and then you bring out, no, not enough, not enough, not, more suitable. And you glob it on in there. And I'm gonna go in for another bit, you know? Like, I love this sour cream, boy. And, oh, yes. Yes. I was gonna plate it, but then I realized I'm the only one eating it. So, uh, bon appetit. Mm. Mm. 
That's so good. Put some more sour cream in there. I'm probably gonna too, going to, and um, yeah. Bless, bless. And I'll see you later, Mother Peppers. Okay, we're done. No, we're done. I just wanted to let you know that I intend to eat all of these mashed potatoes with my hands. Um, if I can get it into my mouth, that is. I did it. Portion control is no joke. Sleep tight, everybody.